Hmm. Okay, this is the cover of a normal stock airbox of a Yamaha SZ153CC single cylinder four stroke engine. Now, what we are doing here is a uh, is a very uh, basic and a very uh, pretty effective modification, and that involves just drilling uh, holes in the cover of the airbox, which allow extra air to come into it without much of the restriction, which, which is usually there. So um, the benefit of this is that your, your engine breathes more freely and as a result the combustion is more proper and the overall response which you get from the engine is supposed to be better. The results however would, uh, would depend greatly on uh, your engine, the uh, design of the airbox and um, a lot of other variables which need to be looked into however uh, for basic purposes uh, you can uh, try something of this sort if you would like to play around with your vehicle. So here's what I have done. I have made a grid out here. I'm not sure if you can see it here, but if you see there are certain lines which have been drawn. Now this is a grid as a result of which I have the whole uh, drill area divided into small squares. Now I'm, I'm just using uh, alternate squares, leaving uh, four squares. So if I take a grid of nine squares, I would have five drilled and four of them would not be drilled. Now that makes for an even pattern. You don't really need to go for an even pattern. You, you, you can go for a haphazard pattern, that's fine. But uh, the, the only uh, advantage of uh, having a properly designed uh, drill area is, is that you, you have a comparatively cleaner looking uh, airbox uh, cover. I have seen people who have just cut this entire area off uh, the box, but that leaves you exposed to a lot of uh, untreated air which can be dusty which can be dirty and that's definitely not good for your air filter it reduces the life so uh, essentially what we are trying to do here is um, arrive at a balance uh, without uh, destroying the looks too much